My friends in Christ, may the Lord be with you. Lord willing, it's Thursday. We're entering into another weekend and worship, and I look forward to being with you. Today I've entitled our devotion, God, Our Strength. And I would like to introduce you to a friend. This friend became my, or this became my friend, oh, almost, or going on 50 years ago. This friend is a favorite Bible passage of mine from the Psalms. And it's, well, perhaps Psalms. You think of Psalms and you think of some of your friends, if you will. Psalm 27, the Lord is my light and my salvation. Psalm 46, God is our refuge and strength. Psalm 23, the Lord is my shepherd. Well, here's one that is a friend of mine that is Psalm from Psalm 73. Psalm 73, verses 25 and 26. Whom have I in heaven but you? And there is nothing on earth that I desire besides you. My flesh and my heart may fail, but God is the strength of my heart and my portion forever. This passage, this promise of God has been a comfort for me to me, like I said, for a long time. What a great song it is. I love this song because it speaks to me of my condition that ultimately, no matter what is going on, my reality is everything can go away like that. Everything on this side of the grave or as the scriptures say, the grass withers, the flower fades. But it doesn't stop there. It says, but the word of our God remains forever. The motto of my first college, St. Paul's College, Concordia, Missouri, said, the word of the Lord endures into eternity. A great promise from God that no matter what is going on, no matter the need, no matter the celebration, the matter, no matter the abundance or the scarcity, we have nowhere else to go but to the Lord. Whom have I in heaven but you? And there is nothing on earth that I desire beside you. My flesh and my heart may fail, but God is the strength of my heart and my portion forever. We know because we know how much more deep this goes, our lives go. My flesh and my heart will fail. It is the nature of flesh and heart. But God is the strength of our heart and our portion forever, our abundance, his love in Jesus, his promise that no matter what, he is our strength, God our strength. He is the one that loves forever, forgives for sure, and walks with us day by day. One of my favorite hymns comes from the end or close of service section in our hymnal. And it is, Guide me, O thou great Redeemer. Guide me, O thou great Redeemer, pilgrim through this barren land. I am weak, but thou art mighty. Hold me with thy powerful hand. Bread of heaven, bread of heaven, feed me till I want no more. Feed me till I want no more. Open now the crystal fountain whence the healing stream doth flow. Let the fiery cloudy pillar lead me all my journey through. Strong deliverer, strong deliverer, be thou still my strength and shield. Be thou still my strength and shield. When I tread the verge of Jordan, bid my anxious fears subside. Death of death and hell's destruction land me safe on Canaan's side. Songs of praises, songs of praises, I will ever give to thee. I will ever give to thee. Let's pray. 
Lord, we give you now songs and praises. We thank you for holding on to us in our lives in this moment, in this day, in these days. We know that no matter what fails, you never will, and you are holding on to us every moment. Thank you for that promise of your presence, of your grace in Jesus. In his name we pray. Amen. God be with you till we meet again.